I remember an old Oman where we literally had very little to go by. No sewage system, no electricity in most cases. Housing conditions were poor. And of course schooling, I believe we had one school in the north and one in the south in Salala. I would say we started from scratch, literally scratch. And what His Majesty did since he took over in 1970 was something that's unbelievable. The time I came here to Oman, it's, it's uh, a few buildings and a couple of roads, uh, nothing else other than the deserted land. From that kind of position, in 40 years' time, today we have come to a position of being one of the strongest nations in the whole region. Development took, you know, was in every category you could imagine. Commerce, education, medical, infrastructure, roads, in every category of the country. Road, hospitals, airport, seaport. Moving into tourism and development resorts, and a lot of industrial infrastructure. Airports, international airports, allowing you know, foreign tourists to, to come in. And all these happen mainly on account of the visionary, uh, wise leadership of His Majesty Sultan Kapus. Of course, supported by able implementation by companies like Kareli and Alavi. In 45 years of trading in the Sultanate, we've been um, proud to have been involved in many of the large, more technically challenging projects. Construction of the Grand Mosque for His Majesty Sultan Qaboos, construction of his guest palace, the current construction of the Royal Opera House, and the new seat of government, the Majlis, which we're currently constructing. Every city in Oman has got Karelian landmark. They've connected uh, this country together.